So in Accelerator, like Dreamit, being four months, it's kind of an arbitrary length of time in the lifespan of a company. Uh, for any of the entrepreneurs in the audience who've seen their way through to an exit, you know that it's, it's a marathon, not a sprint. My journey was nine years, and, and at Dreamit, we fully expect that companies may take many years to see it through to a successful conclusion. And uh, Dreamit is there to help all along the way, post-program. And we also find it instructive at Demo Day and, and useful to kind of share, you've seen companies where they are today, and, and I'm gonna introduce a company that's you know, a graduate of our inaugural healthcare class last summer in Philadelphia, Biomeme. And just to give you a sense of what can be accomplished in just a short period of time, even after Dreamit. So please welcome Max from Biomeme. Thanks, Elliot. I could really use the Phobius app for demo day, because this is not my demo day, but I'm really nervous. Um, and there you go. Okay, I guess it just slides a little bit. So Biomeme enables anyone to do real-time DNA analysis on a smartphone. Richard Dawkins best describes our perspective on this ubiquitous molecule. When he wrote, it's raining DNA outside. It's raining instructions. It's raining programs. This is not a metaphor, it's the plain truth. It couldn't be any plainer if it were raining floppy disks. Biomeme creates products that enable everyone, including you, to access the stored information in DNA to make better decisions. Our products enable you to identify a species of fish, a particular virus, bacteria, fungus, even a genetic trait by its specific DNA signature. Right now, this really is only possible by experienced biologists working in central labs with sophisticated, expensive equipment. But we've taken these capabilities and paired them with your most trusted tool, your personal smart device. So we've enabled and empowered home healthcare technicians to have the critical data that they need at home visits. Actually, uh, Quantified Care, who presented earlier, Mike, he talks about their vision for mobile healthcare devices. And they've actually come up with a concept for uh, a future doctor's kit. Um, th don't worry, this is not it. <laughs> but in, inside this, this, this future doctor's bag are a number of devices, including the Biomeme platform, that can be used for real-time infectious disease analytics at the point of care, as well as other use cases, like screening, for genetic signatures that might indicate uh, drug side effects. So some nine months ago at my demo day, we showed you our consumables kits, our hardware device, and our mobile app. And at that time, I claimed that the system was incredibly easy to use and worked on par with central lab equipment. Our products have come a long way since, since our demo day about nine months ago. It's still just as easy to use. You can actually go online and see my seven-year-old daughter using our platform. Take down the URL. I really want you to see my daughter. <laughs> it includes first consumables kits that take about a minute to isolate DNA from a sample and put them into a test cartridge. The test cartridge then goes into our mobile DNA analysis device. This is a real-time qPCR thermal cycler um, that pairs with your, your personal smart device, in this case, an iOS device. This one's even smaller and more mobile than the one that we, we showed you about eight or nine months ago. And then we have our mobile app that guides users through first scanning a test kit, then actually running the DNA analysis on the machine in real time, and making a diagnosis on the phone in real time. These diagnoses can then be sent wirelessly to a lab management system, a clinician, epidemiologist, et cetera. Now, over the past eight months, we've not only been developing this platform, and, and I'm showing you kind of the latest, but we've also had a number of our prototype devices out with third-party labs, government agencies, and they've been testing the claims that we've been making about the sensitivity of our system. And they've proven that not only is our, our device sensitive enough to identify down to 200, 10, 
even a single strand of DNA or RNA or a toxin. And it's really fun to use. This actually, sorry, my quote, but I think it's really fun to use. <laughs> so right now, our devices are in three different countries around the world. And over the past eight or nine months, we've actually been lining up a number of strategic partnerships that represent a variety of market verticals. First, the Panamanian government is planning the biomeme for infectious diseases at the point of care and do real-time surveillance. Medical investigators are planning a biomeme at crime scenes to identify the time of death of a corpse. And first responders are planning the biomeme suspicious white powders for bio threats, as well as track potential pandemics. And up in Philadelphia, there's a charter school, charter high school called String Theory High School. And they're integrating biomeme into their project-based biology curriculum, where there'll be DNA barcoding and conducting water quality analysis on their tilapia aquaculture and hydroponics operation that are actually in their, in their biology classes. But what gets me really excited is the potential for me to test my own child in my own home and send those results to my doctor where they can interpret them and actually come up with treatment options for me that are based on actual diagnostic data. This was the vision that Mark, Jesse, and I had about a year and a half ago. We then joined the Dream and Health Accelerator in Philadelphia. Maximilian joined on earlier that, or shortly thereafter. And uh, we've recently been able to close our, our $1.6 million funding round. Um, it's kind of funny, we actually, at our demo day, I think I had maybe $700,000 up there, just like everybody else. You're gonna need a lot more. So. <laughs> Um, but we've been able to close on $1.6 million, and we're using that money to not only further validate our systems with a variety of partners, but also commer commercialize our product platform and ramp up on new hires. I just wanted to uh, give a quick shout out to four of our new hires. We've got Emily, Maria, Ruth, and Danielle. Sorry, no Christine this time. If you saw my demo day, you might hit that. But um, we're, we're ramping up with new hires. There's more to come. And uh, I thank you for allowing me to share a little bit more of our, of our traction and progress. And I challenge all of you to think and consider, what will you biomeme in 2015?